crazy cooter scooter coming at you. Uh, springtime has risen. And we are out exploring today. I figure with springtime uh, here, I would take you past uh, U.S. Steel Yard. No, they do not actually still, uh, uh, still, uh, store steel there. It is a uh, baseball um, stadium for the uh, Chicago, uh, no, the Gary Railcats. Sorry about that. Um, and there's a lot of trucks over that way. I don't know exactly what they're doing. Uh, it looks like 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 a lot of camera trucks and all that. We can. I don't think. I think that's only a one. No, it's not a one way. I don't know what's going on down that way. Uh, I wish I did. <laughs> but that's kind of interesting. I, I noticed it when I was coming up. I, 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 so. We are going up this way. Okay. That down. So, as we're coming straight up this road, it'll be on the left-hand side of the road. Yeah. Now, they, they broke ground on the stadium in 2001. It opened up in 2002. Yeah. It's a very pretty stadium. There's the home plate gate, of course. Um, there's other gates, there's a, all kinds of stuff. They, they are getting ready for baseball season, actually. Uh, I believe the Railcats' first game is May, some, is opening days of May for the Gary Railcats. Um, I hope I can find a place. I want to pull up into here. I want to a lot be here. Let's see, there's a lot of cars up in here. I don't know what's going on. But, uh, yeah, there used to be a Bennigan's up in here, too. I think it was down that way. I don't know. But they, when that closed, the uh, Bennigan's closed a long time ago. So now we're riding right behind, uh, basically, right field. They got a playground for the kids. Of course, that's the batter's eye. Like I said, it's opened up in 2002. It is a nice stadium. There you can see uh, the infield and everything else. Yeah, like I said, I, uh, I'm supposing they're getting ready for uh, the season. They, uh, it's going to be a while, uh, like I said, I think it open, they open in May for this, this season, uh, so I'm, I'm sure they're getting spruced up and everything for it. And, um, I will get some more information to let you know what's going on. Uh, hang on a minute, I have a Wikipedia page. I have some stuff, but uh, there's more to it. Uh, it has hosted uh, little league games, uh, high school games, and such like that. I believe it's even held um, a tribute to Michael Jackson at one point, uh, back I think when he passed away or something like that. Uh, yeah, so it can hold up to 6,139 people for baseball, and it's had roughly uh, over... Six million, uh, six thousand at fan attendance, actually. So, yeah, back in 2009, uh, Gary Native Michael Jackson, that's when the attendance happened over six thousand for that. Um, left field to left field from home plate is 320 feet, left center is 380. Straight ahead center field is 400, uh, right center field is 390, and right field is 335. Um, construction cost on the stadium itself was roughly about $45 million. Um, that's about it, really. Uh, the Gary Railcats are actually a minor league, uh, considered a minor league team. They are in the uh, independent team. They are not affiliated with any major league teams. But it, it's a nice stadium. I, I haven't been able to attend a game here. Uh, you know, not that I don't want to. Just <laughs> I haven't had the ability, uh, the the chance to yet. But every time uh, they have a home game or something, I have to work. But it's no big deal. And that is what that is. I, I think that's, uh, you know, I will get here at some point, but I, I want to wind up in, uh, I think that's it for the stadium thing here. But yeah, 
It's interesting. Like I said, I think their first opening game is May in May, sometime in May. With, with baseball season being right around the corner in springtime, hey, why not do it at the stadium? See their grounds crews out there. They might be, you know, I don't know, getting ready for the season. I think this used to be the beginning game, actually. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, of course, um, we are in a one-way street now, so we gotta go up this way. So this is the, uh, front side, uh, anyway, we'll go up this way. I believe we can turn this way. And we can turn this way because we go up this road here. We'll take a left up this road. And we'll go up there. There. Again, we're now we're uh, behind where some of the parking is at. So what we're going to do is we're going to turn up this road, and then we'll ride right behind the back in the stadium and all that stuff. So, but when it it, it runs right along uh, the toll road here. Uh, I think it's 80, uh, 94 or eighty something like that. Um, Correct me if I'm wrong. If you live in the area anyway, basically, it is, since it, the highway, the toll road's there, the stadium's there, U.S. Gary Steelworks is right across the road, basically, and if you go straight, we go straight across, we'd go into there, into that, and I think we're going to have a while for our green light. <laughs> I don't see no traffic, but again, I see Gary cops around, so I can't really, I see cops around, so I can't really do that. I'll just sit here and wait and see what happens. I don't know how long it's going to be, but, eh, it shouldn't be too long, hopefully. I'm going to go up this way. i got a tr semi-truck coming up behind me, so hopefully that'll help. So, uh, trains do on uh, the train tracks, and the South Shore does run along through here as well. I believe those are the South Shore tracks right directly in front of us. So... Hopefully we get turned here and we go right along the back wall of the stadium. Basically the scoreboard's on this side. You ain't going to really see much because the way uh, I'm riding we're on. Because the camera being on the right side and uh, all that stuff. It don't help much. He's going into the middle like I said. And we, now we're going to be able to make our turn here. So Now we are... Running behind the back of the stadium itself. Yeah, that's the batting eye, I guess. Um, yeah, it really looks like they're getting ready for the season. There's a scoreboard and all that. And you, you're riding behind here. You can actually see a game going on when they do have game games. Uh, they do have lights and all that. And uh, they have special nights for the uh, fans and all that. They give, have giveaways and all that. I think that's going to do it for this video. Uh, this is Crazy Cooter Scooter over and out.